Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are actually checking out something really interesting. This is a Lockheed L1049 Super Carney uh, by Dissonance. So, um, yeah, this thing actually looks really cool. Uh, it has a startup procedure, which is um, quite a lot of buttons, but we should actually be able to do this. There is a tutorial that he's made for his own plane, and it is quite a good one. So hopefully we can follow one of those. And we can get this thing started. There is, of course, a lot of buttons in here. Um, there is a little bit of a problem with it so far, though. Um, it started pointing that direction. And now it's pointing into the mountains. But um, I, I guess that's fine. Uh, we also need to try and figure out a way to get in. Um, can I get in there? Do you reckon I can get in that way? Or do I just go in? Can I go in here? How do I get into this thing? Okay, so you do just pull yourself through that little hole. Okay, good. Well, close that up. Fantastic. Uh, we're going to quickly jump over this seat and put the parking brake on. Uh, hopefully that stops us spinning quite so much. All right, nice. So, um, we have a lot of things in here. I, I'm going to try and remember what he turned on um, from the video, from the tutorial. Uh, and I'm going to try and just put them on. So, apparently you only need two generators. You can have one and four or two and three. Um, which means the engine on the ends of the wing is one and four, and the engine's close, I think, at two and three. Um, so just to equal, equal them out, that's it. Anyway, start valve, there we go, good. Cooling flaps, yes. Um, low oil pressure, okay. Um, we're not going to do any of that right now. We've got a throttle, so we'll put it to 0. Oh, 0. 0.11. I can't. I can't quite put it to a... Oh, there we go. Good. Uh, and we're going to put this to 100, I think. Yes. All right. Full mixture. Awesome. Uh, prop pitch is set to zero on start. Okay. Go ahead and put that to zero. Boop. We can't actually... We can't put it on zero. It's not point not one. Okay, good. Hydraulics. Let's go ahead and turn on all of those. Yes. Uh, bleed airs. I'm not sure when we do that. I'm not actually sure. Uh, we got the fuel pumps down here. Yes. Um, okay, we got the tank feeds. Okay, right. So, let's go ahead and put this on. There we go. And then we'll put all of these on. There we go. Good. I think this is all right. What's all of this? All right, bleed air. Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do it. Recirculation fan. Sure. And pack. I don't know what pack is. Um, but there you go. Right, start the engines. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> oh. There we go. Okay, so he said they should start spinning. And then we can turn these off. Alright, nice. And then do the same on this one. So that one and that one are on. We just need this one and this one to spool up. They go to zero RPS and then they go up uh, from there. So there we go. Then we turn both of these off. That's nice. You can fly without the battery, uh, apparently. That's cool. Um, let's get in the seat. Avionics on. There we go. We got flaps. We got gear. Uh, apparently, the front landing gear isn't very strong. Um, so, landing and stuff is going to be difficult. Um, but we should be able to do it. That's that's what we're going to go with. What is this? Pitch hold. Do not use below. No oh, point. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Uh, prop pitch. That's not really doing anything. The taxi speed. Okay, do we have any... Wait, 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 wait. I don't think we got, um... Nose wheel steering here. I don't think that's doing anything. Uh, smoke belt, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, cockpit lights, sure. Nav lights, yes. Cabin lights, yes. Landing lights, no. Drove beacons, yep. Left wing, oh. We don't need that on. We don't need that on. Um... Okay, good. Emergency shut off. Emergency shut off. We don't need any of those. Oh, here. Maybe it's this. We need to turn these on. There we go. Okay, good. So we turn this off. We should be able to turn left. The front landing gear is moving. Okay. And hopefully we can turn just enough to actually get on this runway. Alright, so if everybody's ready, we're going to go ahead and throttle up. 
Okay, good. We're gonna go ahead and pitch up. Did I just stall out the engines? Did I break it? I think I broke it. Uh-oh. Alright, brake on. Good. Turn these down. I think I broke the engines. This is my bad. I'm sorry. Okay, right, that's fine. Taxi throttle. Prop pitch. Okay. Oh, wow, we could go to zero. Oh, minus, sorry. Okay, right, leave it here. And we'll try and start the engines again. We'll just do it like this. Okay. So they should start spinning. Yes. Okay, that's happening. And... Oh, sorry. On start set to 0.17. My bad. Um... Oh, no. I broke this. I've broken it. Uh-oh. Um, that is a big uh-oh. Okay, so I just restarted the thing, and we are now, like, going in a circle, and I'm going to try and pull up- Oh, boy! Okay, right. That was lucky. We are now going to fall out the sky, because I've over-revved it or something? I don't know, we're dead. Uh, <laughs> rip! Okay, right, we need to- we need to follow the instructions a little bit more. Um, okay. Right, let's respawn it, and we'll try again. Okay, so let's go ahead and try that again. Jump inside, here we go. Are you just going through the little hatch right here in the wheel? That's fine. You have to crouch and things, but that's okay. Good. Uh, then we're going to sit in our little seat. We're going to put on the parking brake at the front. We're going to go ahead and put in the battery, all the bus ties. That's fine. We're going to put the oil pumps on now uh, so that we generate enough oil. I think we have to wait for those to go off. Not entirely sure. Uh, we'll put two generators on, we'll put all the start valves on, there we go, and all of the cooling flaps. They're all on as well, so that's fine. Everything here is uh, a-okay, I think. Uh, go ahead and put all the hydraulics on, that's fine. Um, we're going to go ahead and turn on the fuel pumps down here. We're going to put this to full on rich. Uh, we're going to put this to 0.18, that's fine, I think. And this to zero. Okay, right, so we'll leave it like that for now, and I guess we'll start two engines. Yeah, okay, right, so we do this, and that should go to zero. Yeah, and it should start up, that's good. So the engine is now on, but it's not revving high enough. Hmm. Right, we're also supposed to put bleed air on for two engines, so we'll go ahead and do that. There we go. Um, still low oil pressure, so I guess we need to start more engines. I mean, that doesn't seem to make sense, but we will. We'll start the other engines. There we go, they're on. And this one as well. Still low oil pressure, okay. Fine, we need to figure that out. We need to sort out what's going on there. All the oil pumps are on, so I think it should be fine. I think I might have a bit of an issue here. Uh, not so sure, but we'll 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 go with it anyway. Um, yeah, so we got generator failure on all of those. We got hydraulic failure on all of these. Uh, what are these things? Fire bottle discharge. Okay, right. That's the entry. That's fine. Um, whoa, okay, right. I don't know how to take off with this thing. We almost did it um, earlier on, so we'll do those. Emergency shut off, we don't need those right now. Cabin lights, yes. Nav lights, yes, yes, yes. Bing, boom. All right, cool. Uh, avionics, sure. And, I mean, it should really be ready to go. It should be, but it's not. Hmm. We still got issues. Still got very big issues. Uh, see how the, they, they're not, they're just spinning. They're not doing anything else, though. Their RPS is very low. Okay, so, I'm not sure how we fix that. Okay, so it does say on here, after start, set back to idle. So we go back to 0.17. There we go. Okay, we're back to 0.17. Our RPS is still 4. That doesn't seem to be right. Um, 
put that back up to full. Okay. We should be able to turn these off. But then the engines are dying. So that doesn't make too much sense. Okay, so after all that time, uh, I just missed this. So you actually have to uh, pump this around. Uh, my bad. I didn't... I didn't... I don't know whether I saw that in the video. Um, but anyway, uh, you have to turn on all of these. Um, or at least one of these? Some of these. Um, but that's fine. We've actually got it on now, so that's good. Um, we need to turn those off. Everything is running fine. Okay, good. Now we can sit in the front seat. We can turn the brake off. Uh, we can throttle up, I think. And we can pitch up as well. And we should start moving. Yes. Oh, we need to turn these on. Otherwise, you get no control. So it's one and three. Here we go. And we are flying. All right, so uh, once you actually follow the instructions properly, it does work. We got a stall warning. Okay, we got a gear. So we're going to put the landing gear in. There we go. Oh, that is beautiful. That is very beautiful. And uh, we're just going to keep flying. So yes, it actually flies. It works. Um, I just missed a step in the instructions. And if you miss a step, uh, it doesn't work, uh, which is perfect. That's actually a really good thing. So I'm happy about that. I'm very happy. Uh, how do I turn off a stall warning? It says we are going to stall, but um, yeah, I, d I don't think we are. I don't think we are. Roll leveler. Okay. Uh, and pitch level. So if we go down to 0 0.68 and we do this. It is pretty much an auto leveling thingy bobby uh, and it works. So anyway, now we're in the sky. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Um, we've got some e equipment stuff right there. Okay, good. Um, and if we go even further backwards, we got like a first class kind of lobby. Um, oh, actually, I think they're all the same. I think it's just because there's a equipment here and a lavatory. Um, but yeah, we got a bunch of seats right here with little tables. Do these seats actually look pretty cool? Um, we've obviously got like arms for the for the seats. We got overhead lockers, which don't actually do anything, but that's fine. Uh, and if we go all the way to the back, we've got more and a little cargo area. If we wanted to use the cargo area, we could. That's pretty cool. Uh, we've also got like a um, a galley. Yes, that's what it's called. Um, at the back, and uh, you can make drinks and things there if you wanted to, I guess. We've also got an emergency exit with a door. Uh, and a parachute. Yes! Nice! Well, anyway, quickly run back to the front and uh, we'll attempt to land it because I do want to try and land this thing. Um, stall warning. How do I turn that off? How do I turn off the stall warning? I did take off without flaps. That is true. That is definitely true. Um, we're not going to fly at the Arctic today, so we're going to turn around. Uh, and we're going to land on that runway right there. The multiplayer island because... That seems like a good runway to land on. So if we can land and it's still able to take back off again, I'm going to go ahead and say that that is a good old landing. Um, I haven't got to the point in the tutorial where there is a landing. So um, this is this is all in my head. This is all in my head. We don't have a... Um, yeah, all right. Okay, turn this off. That's fine. Okay, good. Are we going to slow it down a little bit? There we go. We're going to line ourselves up, hopefully. And we're going to put the landing gear down, the flaps down. There we go. Okay, so far so good. Left landing gear is out. The right one isn't. The right landing gear is stuck, question mark. It's not coming out. It's not coming out. Those two did. The one on the right isn't, isn't, isn't playing ball. Uh-oh. Uh, landing gear up, landing gear down. Oh no. Okay, well we can't land now, uh, because the landing gear is bodged. What is going on over there? Look at it. Okay, right. The doors opened and now they're closed. Now do it again. The doors aren't opening on the right landing gear. It's not letting it come down. Oh, that's really annoying. That's very annoying. We're going to have to land with two two landing gears. Oh, boy. Okay, that's not good. That is actually very bad. <laughs> um, 
We might want to find the military runway and try and land there. Um, they might have fighter engines, maybe. We're gonna continue to try and try and get that landing gear down, but it, it just doesn't appear to be working. Um, what if we turn this on? Maybe that'll help. Maybe that will help. I don't think it will, but here we go, do that. Come on! No. See how the left one, the doors open straight away, and the right one, it just doesn't? Oh, no. Okay, right, we've got a failure. We need to, um, we definitely need to land this thing. And, uh, we need to land it somewhere safe. So, where is the military island? Probably, actually, the multiplayer island might be good enough. It might be. In fact, it probably is. Uh, but I think that's the military island over there. Let's have a little look on the map, see what it looks like. Yes, we found the military island. We'll land over there. Um, but yeah, landing gear is not coming out. It is... It is not deploying. Um, I don't know how to fix that. I have no idea how to fix that. I don't think I can. So, we're going to be landing on two wheels. Um, and hopefully that's fine. <laughs> Maybe. Right, we're going to bring the gear back up again. We're, we're going to keep trying this until we, uh, until we fix it. But um, I don't know whether we can fix it. We are not lined up on either of the runways, so we're going to have to fly left a bit. Uh, the landing gear is, of course, up now, so if we push it down again... The door just isn't opening. It's just its just not opening. Uh, we could do some aerobatics. Maybe if I wiggle a bit. I'm wiggling the plane to try and drop it out. Come on, landing gear. Come on, landing gear. Nope. Not really doing its thing. Alright, we're going to speed up then. We're going to speed up. And that landing gear is going to fall out. Right? It's not. It's not actually doing anything. Okay, right. Come on. Turn back around to the right. We're going to land with two landing gears. Um, because that's all we got. That is all we got. All right, landing gear go back down. That door is just not opening. It, it's just not. So we are going to struggle with this landing. But it, oh, it's going to be fine, I swear. Alright, so uh, we still aren't really lined up very well here. Uh, I have slowed down slightly, and the landing gear still isn't down. Right, we're going to try it one more time. Lift it up. Okay, and pop it back down. <gasps> Wait, it actually came down. It came down that time. Okay, we no longer have to land at this runway. But, uh... Oh, it's a very small runway, actually, isn't it? Jeez, uh... Okay. I'm trying my best. I can break. Ah, no! Rip! Rip! No! Straight in the water, yeah. Um, of course, I'm not very used to landing this thing, but um, I would say that that was a, it was a decent landing. Maybe a bit hard, but um, if we were on a longer runway, that would have been awesome. Um, but with that being said, I am going to take off again. We're going to try it more. Um, in in normal terms, I would have I would have stopped the video here, but we're gonna we're gonna keep going. It's such a weird looking aircraft, isn't it? Like it's it's just not straight. <laughs> it's very it's like bent over. It's weird. It's very weird. Anyway, uh, grab onto the top handle, jump back in. Yes. Uh, I'm going to turn it all back on again. So we battery this, 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 this. Uh, we do two of these. And then we do all of these. Good. Uh, we do all of those as well. That's fine. Uh, put the brake on just before we start everything else. Oil pumps. Go ahead and turn those on. Uh, turn on two bleed airs. Turn on all of the hydraulic system. Yes. Turn on the fuel pumps. Uh, of course. There we go. Set this to fully rich. Set this to 17. Set this to zero. Uh, and I believe that's fine. Now we turn on these things and cross feed. There we go. Uh, and then we start the engine. So we do this, this. Uh, we'll do them like two at a time. There we go. So it's at zero. It should go up to five. And then we turn it off. Same with that one. Okay. And then these two we need to turn on. That's good. Nice. We need to wait for the RPS to go up. But it, you can see it from the outside. The engines actually start when the smoke comes out, so... There you go, the smoke is coming out. Awesome, go ahead and turn these off. And that is fine. Alright, good, we're doing things. Um, turn those on as well, and the uh, your dampener. Good. Uh, turn this back to 11. Hard to get to 11. 
Bob will probably do. Uh, and sit in the seat. All right, turn on all the lights. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Cockpit light, nav lights. Landing lights I don't like to use. Uh, taxi lights, no. Runway turn off lights. What? Uh, patrol heat, yep, there we go. And that is fine, all right. Let's go ahead and sit in our little seat. We'll turn flaps on, we'll turn avionics on. Turn the parking brake off, turn all of these controls on, and here we go, throttle up. We almost stalled there, I think? Yeah, all right, we're in the air, good. Uh, landing gear needs to come up, there we go, nice job. And we need to go into the sky, all right, yeah, up we go. Is the stall warning on this time? No, it's not. Okay, the gear is up. That's nice. The flaps are gonna come up as well. And we are flying away. This is awesome. Right, so, uh, I actually wanna land at the multiplayer island, so let's go ahead and uh, get level with that. And, um, yeah, we should be fine from there, I think. That's awesome. Yeah, so once you're used to this thing, turning it on and off is easy, very easy. It's just getting to that point though, isn't it? It is. Um, so yeah, we've got this and this. We'll go ahead and put both of those on, that's fine. As long as you're not below 0.65, which we definitely aren't, uh, you are completely fine, so that's good. Yeah, we're doing things. We're actually doing things. All right, everybody ready? Everybody is ready. Yes, I think, yep. All right, landing gear, please come out. Please, please, please. Go ahead and turn this down to 0.66. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, landing gear it actually came out this time. All right, cool. Turn this off, turn this off. Okay, it does have a tendency to like follow the course that you were going on when you do turn those off, uh, but that's fine. Okay, and here we go. So this, I believe, is one of the longest runways in the game. If we don't land here, or if we can't land here, uh, we've probably got an issue. But we do have reverse thrust, don't we? Yes, we do. So, uh, this should be fine. This should be completely fine. Should be a good landing. Because we're not landing at that one, we're landing at that one. Uh, in case anyone thought I was coming in at a really weird angle. Uh, can we do it in first person? I can't really see. <laughs> I can't really see because all these bars are really thick. Um, but there you go. Right, come on. We got this. We got this. We're not going to land on the taxiway. We're going to land on the runway. And everything is going to be completely fine. Like, completely fine. Here we go. We're, we're ready. We are ready. And we're coming in. Slow it down maybe a bit. Whoa, that was bad. That was pretty bad. Um, but we are landed. We have landed. Throttle down all the way. And it is in a state where it can take off again, so let's do it. Oh, we're going backwards. We are actually going backwards. Okay, because the prop pitch, I turned it around. Here we go. And into the sky we go. Yeah. Oh, I like this. Uh, we didn't actually use flaps for takeoff or landing there, but that's fine. All right, turn it around. We're going to try and fly back to the creative base, and we're going to put it down there. And that'll be us, I think. Yeah. Dude, I love it. That's awesome. All right, so if everybody's ready, uh, we are landing on the creative base, as you guys can see. Hopefully, we have a bit of a better landing situation this time. Uh, we're going to try and come in a little bit slower. We're not going to try and use the reverse thrust to land, um, because that's kind of what I did there. Um, but this is going to be fine. We are lined up with this runway pretty well. Uh, we're going to make sure the landing gear goes down by putting it down now. Uh, yeah, it eventually bullied its way out. That's good. Uh, we're going to obviously slow down. So do that. There we go. We're going to go to like 0 0.57. Yeah. I guess this is slow enough. Yeah, it probably is. It probably is slow enough. Uh, when we land, we're going to put the packing brakes on. We're going to put flaps on for landing. That's good. We need to go over to the right slightly. That's okay. All right, here we go. Come on, we got this. We got this. Oh, doesn't it look beautiful, though? Doesn't it? I think it looks great. Oh, it looks amazing. All right, here we go. Come on. 
So, as we go in the land, we're gonna slow down a bit more. Um, do, 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 do. Do, do. Slow down now. Slow down a little bit more. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Hiking brake. We need reverse thrust. We actually need it. Uh, there we go. We did it. We did it. <laughs> no! Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Whoops. <laughs> well, we landed. We did land. Uh, and now we are in the uh, in the ocean. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave the, uh, the link to this in the description down below. Uh, if you guys want to check it out, it will be down there. And um, yeah, dude, this thing is awesome. It is so cool. Um, but yeah, anyway, thank you guys for watching. Sorry it took so long to actually uh, start this video. Actually taking off with this thing um, to begin with was a little bit of a pain in the bum. Uh, but once you're used to it, it does work. So um, yeah, there is also a tutorial if my video didn't help you. <laughs> um, because I don't see why it would. Anyway, um, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.